Hi, I'm James and today I'm in the Atomos studio with the new Kinect range. The new Kinect range transforms your camera into a fully integrated device that supports a range of advanced cloud-based workflows with Frame.io, Twitch and more. In this setup guide, we show you how to connect your Atomos Connect and Shogun Connect to Frame.io for a range of cloud-based workflows. To complete these steps, you'll need to have set up an Atomos Cloud Studio and Frame.io account. To set up an Atomos Cloud Studio account, go to atomos.cloud, sign up, choose a region closest to where you're using your devices. This will be important for an efficient data workflow. Physical connections. Connect your camera to your Atomos device via an HDMI or SDI cable. Configure your device and enable connectivity. Power on your Atomos device. On this page, set your region. It is important to set this correctly. You'll see a notification saying you are changing your country. Tap Proceed. Tap to enter the input menu and scroll to the Connect menu. Tap the icon in the bottom right hand corner of the device to enable network features. You'll see a Reboot Required notification. Tap OK. When the device reboots, you'll see a Thanks for Updating notification. Tap OK. Set your time. Tap to enter the input menu and scroll to the Wi-Fi or the Ethernet menus. Wi-Fi. Select the network you'd like to connect to. Enter the password and tap OK. A green tick will indicate when you've connected to your network. Ethernet. Connect Ethernet cable to your device. Select DCHP for auto configuration or select static for manual configuration. Configure your Frame.io projects for Camera to Cloud. Before selecting Frame.io Camera to Cloud as a destination in Atomos Cloud Studio, you'll need to have created a project that you can select as a media destination and ensure that in the settings for the project, you have enabled C2C connections. To enable C2C connections, click the toggle switch at C2C Connections to on when creating a new project from the web app, mobile web, or in the Frame.io iOS app. You can also enable C2C connections on an existing project by clicking the three dots in the top right corner and selecting project settings. An edit project dialog box will open where you can click to toggle the switch at C2C connections to on. To pair Atomos device to Cloud Studio. Scroll to the connect menu. Here we can see that we're connected to the network but not to Cloud Studio. Tap pair. Notate the three provided words. Scan the QR code or go to atomos.cloud. In the Atomos Cloud browser, tap Add Device. Enter the three words you notated from earlier. Give your device a relevant nickname. You'll now see in your device that you have successfully connected to the network and to Cloud Studio, but the device mode is not configured with a destination. To make Frame.io your destination, in Atomos Cloud, tap Add Destination. Then select Frame.io and log into your account. Atomos uses this software often, so my login details are here automatically. You'll be asked if you want to allow this device to access your Frame.io assets. Tap Allow. Now, select the project you'd like to send your media. This can be changed at any time within Cloud Studio. A green circular icon denotes that you're connected. This converts into an arrow when uploading media to the cloud. Camera to cloud. Hit record and watch your proxies fly through the cloud and into your Frame.io account for your remote editor to access anywhere in the world. You are now ready. If you require more support, please visit atomos.com support. Go get creative.